So, hello everyone. Um, I just wanted to do a quick update video, really. But I've been meaning to do this video for a while, and I was going to talk about a couple of things, and I can remember one of them, but not the other. Uh, but since the original idea of making a little update video, uh, a few more things have happened uh, that I want to tell you. So, the first original point was... Well, actually, first, ha... ha the Happy New Year, hope you all had a good Christmas and um, New Year uh, and with it all going into lockdown and stuff, pretty miserable though uh, the little community around here, we had a good fire outside and um, uh, some food and yeah, it, it was good around here um, but now it is currently the 2nd of December, this video will be released as soon as I can the first piece of news is for anyone new, because thank you all, oh yes that was the other point, I remembered it now, thank you all so much for 400 subscribers, I really, I, I, I'm just really happy because it's taken a long time to get to this point, and um, yeah, thank you to the 400th subscriber and all you other, have got not 408 now I think, um, and I'm, I really appreciate it honestly, I do, uh, I've been meaning to make this video since I got it, um, but anyway, the second point that I was originally going to make is for all you new viewers and who haven't watched like videos from like nearly a year ago I would think it was is this is not going to be my final van um, this was simply having a first van uh, so once I think you have to I, ha I haven't looked into it properly yet, but I've heard some things here and there. I think you have to have been driving for one year before you can drive uh, a van. Uh, I may totally just made that up, um, but don't take my word for it. But I think that's that's what's kind of you got to do. Or some co insurance companies won't insure you unless you've been driving uh, for a year. Um, I don't know if it's legal or illegal, but I th maybe it's the insurance company who just think it's too high risk but anyway that is one reason why is because after a year of driving I'm gonna drive from a car tiny little car that you drive as a first car to a van so it was a good idea to get a smaller van rather than a massive Iveco uh, as a first van and then also I c I'll sell this one on build another and maybe possibly be able to start business here but I'm not sure we'll, we'll see how far we get but I plan to maybe sell this one convert another one sell that and then have enough money to convert to I don't know we'll see what happens it's it's I'm just kind of rough planning here um, because yeah front wheel drive Citroen relay with low ground clearance it's not my dream van big long Iveco probably a six and a half ton or you know dual axle ones um, probably one of them extra long wheelbase maybe extra high top you never know basically a, a very big van and it'd be built for off-road uh, but this one is more kind of being designed around you know little holidays and actual camper van maybe you could you could easily live in it because I am <laughs> but anyway yeah that's that point um, and then so on New Year's Eve um my hard drive decided to crap its pants and die and because my laptop was been playing up recently as well and when you shut the lid it would not start and it just that was it but I managed to do some googling and there's some weird Mac commands you can do and you can bring it back to life and I did and then I did it again I had to do that again uh, but I eventually got there got there in the end um, but that made me use my spare hard drive for all my data to back up my laptop so then I only had a terabyte um, of all my YouTube videos and pictures and everything uh, and only one copy of it, it wasn't backed up which was risky but like my laptop was in need and then a hard drive, not an SSD, being a hard drive um, it just failed on me really uh, so the whole video on the cooker that I did is lost um, there was a video I did because I built my girlfriend a box for Christmas that's gone as well, all the footage for that. Uh, the footage for the start of the kitchen is gone, but it wasn't very good footage anyway. It was pretty much laid out on the floor and then all of a sudden it was in the van. So yeah, it wasn't very good filming. I didn't film much that day anyway. 
Um, apart from that, I can't think of what else is missing. I'm sure I'll find some other things. There's like templates for my thumbnail and stuff. Basically, it's all going to have to start from scratch. Uh, and I don't have the money to buy another hard drive at the moment, so I'm going to have to use what's left on my laptop storage. Uh, so yeah. But it's all okay at the moment. I'm, I, I didn't panic too much uh, because I've had hard drive fail on me all the time, but I've always had a backup. So. I was kind of ready, because this one had lasted a fairly decent time, I think about a year, and they get abused when they own by me. I kind of don't treat a hard drive as delicately as it should be treated, which is my own fault, so I'm, that's why I'm not really that upset about it, because it, it was basically my own fault. I don't, I don't treat a hard drive how delicately it should be treated, so totally my fault. Um, but I will do a walkthrough of the cooker. Uh, video and luckily I've still got video template because that is kept on my laptop because iMovie keeps things on your laptop so yeah but that is the news for now and as you can see the van has come a long way we have overhead cupboards we've got a ceiling that video is coming out soon the tap video came out today which if you haven't seen you can go check out up here uh, but yeah so it's all happening and I'm I'm really hoping you're enjoying it, and if you're not subscribed and you are watching this video, I really appreciate it. Let's see if we can get to 500 by my birthday, which is the 15th of February. Let's see. I don't know. Highly doubt it. Maybe 450. 450. We'll get 450 for my birthday. Doubt it. But, fingers crossed. So yeah, I've got all the dimmable lights in now, and you can see that, and you can turn it off, and you can turn it on if you can find the button. And um, I've got cooker in, I've got the drawers framed, I've got both overhead cupboard, cupboards roughly in, they both uh, need underneath and cupboard doors doing. Um, I've got back doors done, I've got hessian round the pillars, I've got a box up here, I've got um, portholes in, I don't know if the porthole videos have come out yet, I don't think they have. I've got a whole bulkhead. Uh, yeah, it's it's really coming along. So, if you are enjoying the videos, like I said, subscribe, hit the notification bell, drop a comment down below uh, what you think of the van so far. I'll do some um, B-roll tomorrow morning. Uh, but yeah, the, the lights is just creating a nice little setting. Um, uh, but yeah, they're they're cool lights. Uh, everything will be linked when the videos comes out. And also like this video if you haven't already. And I'll see you on Saturday.